in this video, I am going to teach you top 10 best ethical hacking and penetration testing. These tools are very commonly used in used by security experts and hackers. These tools are very useful to find vulnerability, password recover, data packet scanning, port scanning, etc. Social Engineering Toolkit If you are into pretty serious penetration testing stuff, this should be one of the best tools you should check out. It strengthens organization against ethical hacking, protect against attacks. It helps to manage security risks precisely. It prepares against phishing exploits which could pose threat to crucial company data. Next is BEF. Browser Exploitation Framework is yet another impressive tool. It has been tailored for penetration tester to assess the security of a web server or web browser. This is one of the best Kali Linux tools because a lot of users do want to know and fix the client side problems when talking about web security. Next is Nmap Network Mapper. Nmap or Network Mapper is one of the most popular tools on Kali Linux for information gathering. Nmap is an open source tool for vulnerability scanning and network discovery, which is totally free. Nmap is used to scan and identify, identify which devices are running in system and discovering hosts. Nmap scan is a security tool, not a tech tool. Okay, Nmap detects and reports open ports. Next is Wireshark. Wireshark is the world leading network traffic analyzer and an essential tool for any security professional for system ad or system administrator. Wireshark supports most major internet transfer protocols. These free tools let you analyze network traffic in real time. It is often the best tool for troubleshooting issues on your network. Wireshark intercept, intercept traffic and converts that binary traffic into human readable format. This makes it easy to identify what traffic is causing your network. <clears throat> Next is Multigo. This the tool is used in online investigation for finding relationships between pieces of information from various sources located on the internet. The first phase is security assessment is to focus on collecting as much information as possible about a target application. Information gathering has always been a crucial part of any penetration testing. The more information we have, the more likely we will be able to use that against the system to exploit it. There are basically two types of information gathering active and passive. Active information gathering, the attacker will be directly contacting the target and will be trying to gather information. Passive information gathering is where the attacker won't be contact, contacting the target directly and will be trying to gather information that is available on the internet. Next is aircrack. Aircrack is a complete suite of tools to assess Wi-Fi security. It focuses on different areas of Wi-Fi security. Monitoring. First is monitoring. Packet capture and export of data to text files for further processing by the third-party tools. Next is attacking. Replay attack, deauthentication, fake access point, and other via packet injection. Next is testing. Checking Wi-Fi cards and driver capability capture and injection. Next is Nikto Website Vulnerability Scanner. Nikto is a free software command line vulnerability scanner that scan web server for dangerous files, outdated server software and other problems. Nikto Website Scanner discover non-web application and script vulnerability in a website. Nikto allows pen tester, hacker, and developer. <clears throat> Sorry, 
to examine a web server to find potential programs and security vulnerability these including these are server and software misconfigurations default files and programs insecure files and programs outdated server and programs next is metasploit the metasploit framework is a very powerful tool which can be used by cyber criminals as well as ethical hacker to probe systematic vulnerability on network and servers metasploit project is a computer security project that provide information about security vulnerabilities and aids in penetration testing and ideas in signature development the metasploit framework contain a suit of tool that you can use to test security vulnerability enumerate network execute attack and evade detection metasploit framework is a ruby based modular penetration testing platform that enables you to write test and execute exploit code next is obsdb a web z attack proxy is one of the world most popular web application security testing tools the web z tools can be used during web application development by the by web developer or by experienced security expert during penetration test to assess web application for vulnerabilities zap is designed specifically for web application testing and flexible and extensible it can helps you automatically find security vulnerability in your web application while you are developing and testing your applications next is nessus nessus is one of the most vulnerability scanners used during vulnerability assessment and penetration testing engagement including malicious attacks Nessus is a remote security scanning tool which scan a computer and raises an alert if it discovers any vulnerabilities that malicious hackers could use to gain access to any computer you have connected to a network if you have a computer connected to a network Nessus can help find vulnerabilities that a potential attacker may take advantage of if you are an administrator for multiple computer connected to a network you can make use of it and secure those computers if you like my videos thanks for watching so please like and subscribe my youtube channel also like my facebook page link, link is in the description below take care of yourself i will meet you in another video goodbye